Welcome to our journey into the fascinating world of synchronicities. Synchronicity is a concept first introduced by the Swiss psychiatrist Carl Jung. It refers to the occurrence of two or more events that are meaningfully related, yet not causally related by conventional standards. These events seem to be connected by more than mere chance, resonating with personal significance and often occurring at pivotal moments in our lives. Today, I'll guide you through understanding synchronicities and how you can spot them in your own life. Part one, understanding synchronicities. Synchronicities are often described as coincidences that are too coincidental to be just coincidences. Imagine, for example, thinking about an old friend you haven't seen in years and then unexpectedly running into them the same day. Or perhaps you stumble upon a book that addresses the exact problem you've been grappling with just when you needed it most. These instances might feel like the universe is winking at you, nudging you to pay attention. Carl Jung believed that synchronicities occur when there is a powerful alignment between our internal states, our thoughts, emotions, dreams, and the external world. This alignment transcends time and space, suggesting a deeper underlying order. Jung linked this phenomenon to what he called the collective unconscious, a kind of universal data bank of human experience and knowledge that influences all of our individual experiences. Part two, historical and contemporary interpretations of synchronicities. Throughout history, different cultures and spiritual traditions have recognized phenomena akin to synchronicities, though they might have been described or understood through various lenses. In many indigenous cultures, for example, there is a profound respect for the interconnectedness of all things, often reflected in their storytelling and spiritual practices. These narratives commonly emphasize the significance of signs and omens, seen as messages from the spiritual world or ancestors. In the modern world, interpretations of synchronicities continue to evolve. Alongside Jung's psychological framework, there are those who interpret synchronicities through quantum mechanics and the concept of non-locality, where events are linked regardless of distance without any direct interaction. This parallels some of the mystical insights found in Eastern philosophies like Buddhism and Hinduism, which speak of the interconnectedness of all phenomena. Part three, different types of synchronicities. Synchronicities can manifest in various forms and recognizing these can help you become more attuned to their presence in your life. Here are a few types. Simultaneous occurrence. Two or more events occur at the same time which seem related but lack a direct causal link. For instance, you might be humming a rare song only to hear it on the radio moments later. Symbolic resonance. You encounter symbols in your external environment that resonate deeply with your personal life. Maybe you see recurring numbers, animals, or names that hold particular significance for you. Mirrored circumstances. You experience a situation that mirrors your thoughts, feelings, or dreams. For example, you might dream of an event that later unfolds in real life in a similar or metaphorical way. Part four, the significance of synchronicities. The importance of synchronicities isn't merely in their occurrence, but in what they signify. They often appear during times of personal transformation, decision-making, or when we need affirmation or guidance. They can serve as clues pointing us towards paths or decisions we might not have considered. Some interpret these moments as spiritual or mystical insights, while others see them as the subconscious mind communicating through the external world. Before we continue, if you are enjoying this video and gaining any sort of value out of it, consider subscribing and liking this video for more content that will help you raise your consciousness. Let's continue with the topic. Part five, how to spot synchronicities. Spotting synchronicities requires an open and observant mindset. Here's how you can increase your chances of noticing synchronicities in your daily life. Mindfulness and awareness. Be present in the moment. The more mindful you are, the more likely you are to notice the extraordinary and the ordinary. Journaling. Keep a journal of coincidences and unusual occurrences. Over time, you might begin to see patterns or recurring themes that could signify deeper synchronicities at play. Reflect on your dreams. Young place great importance on dreams, seeing them as messages from the unconscious. By paying attention to your dreams, you might find connections to your waking life that you might otherwise miss. Look for patterns and symbols. 
Our lives are richer and more interconnected than we often realize. By looking for and reflecting on patterns and symbols that recur in your life, you may uncover synchronicities that offer guidance or reassurance. Part six, interpreting synchronicities. Interpreting synchronicities is a deeply personal process. What one person views as a meaningful synchronicity, another might see as a simple coincidence. Trust your intuition and feelings. If an event feels significant to you, take time to ponder its possible meanings and implications. How does it relate to your life? Does it offer any new perspectives or directions? Part seven, synchronicities in everyday life. Let's look at practical examples to illustrate how synchronicities might manifest in everyday life. Consider someone who has been feeling stuck in their career, unsure whether to pursue a passion project they dream about. One day they randomly meet an old friend who has successfully started their own business in the same field. This encounter could be seen as a synchronistic event, providing motivation and possibly even practical help for the career change. Another example could be encountering a specific animal repeatedly, which in many traditions might carry symbolic significance. If someone sees a hawk frequently while going through a period of seeking clarity or direction, they might interpret these sightings as a sign to pay attention to the broader vision of their life and to focus on their goals. Part eight, how to use synchronicities for personal growth. Recognizing and interpreting synchronicities can be more than just acknowledging these occurrences. They can serve as catalysts for personal growth and transformation. Here's how you can actively engage with synchronicities. Contemplation and meditation. When you experience a synchronicity, Spend some time in contemplation or meditation. Reflect on the possible meanings and how they might relate to your life circumstances. Dialogue with others. Sometimes discussing a synchronistic event with others can provide different perspectives and deepen your understanding of its significance. Follow up with action. If a synchronicity suggests a certain course of action or decision, consider following up with concrete steps. This might involve researching a new interest reconnecting with someone, or making changes in your personal or professional life. Emotional and intuitive listening. Pay attention to your emotions and intuition regarding synchronicities. These internal responses can guide your interpretation and actions. Part nine, challenges and criticisms of synchronicities. While many find synchronicities insightful, there are also criticisms and challenges to consider. Skeptics argue that the human mind is predisposed to seek patterns and connections, a psychological phenomenon known as apophenia. This can lead to attributing significance to mere coincidences. Furthermore, reliance on synchronicities without critical thinking can sometimes lead to misguided decisions. It's important to balance enthusiasm for synchronicities with a grounded approach. Be open to the possibility of meaningful connections, but also critical in assessing their relevance and authenticity. Part 10, integrating synchronicities into a holistic worldview. As we wrap up our exploration of synchronicities, it's valuable to consider how integrating awareness of these phenomena into our lives can enrich our understanding of the world and our personal development. Embracing synchronicities involves recognizing the fluid interplay between our inner thoughts and feelings and the outer world. Here's how you can incorporate this understanding into a holistic worldview. Interconnectedness. Begin by fostering an appreciation for the interconnectedness of all things. This mindset encourages a deeper engagement with the world around us, prompting us to consider how our actions and thoughts resonate within a larger context. Holistic decision-making. When making decisions, consider not only the logical and practical aspects, but also the intuitive and synchronistic messages you might be receiving. This balanced approach can lead to more satisfying and meaningful outcomes. Personal symbolism. Develop an understanding of your personal symbols and signs. Just as dreams utilize personal and universal symbols to convey messages, synchronicities often use these symbols to communicate deeper insights. Part 11. Advanced techniques for recognizing and utilizing synchronicities. For those who want to delve deeper into the practice of recognizing and using synchronicities, Advanced techniques can be employed to enhance sensitivity and understanding. Active imagination, a technique developed by Carl Jung. Active imagination involves engaging with the unconscious through dialogue, visualization, or other forms of creative expression. 
This practice can help you interpret the symbolic meanings of synchronicities and integrate them into your conscious understanding. Synchronicity. Walks. Occasionally go for a walk with no specific destination in mind. Open to observing any signs or symbols that seem to speak directly to you. This practice can help heighten your awareness of the synchronistic events that occur around you. Pattern tracking. Over time, track the patterns and themes that arise in your synchronicities. This can reveal deeper insights into your life's narrative and potential future directions. Part 12, Synchronicities and Collective Experience. Synchronicities are not only personal, but can also occur on a collective level, influencing groups, communities, or even entire societies. Historical events sometimes align in ways that seem to point to a collective unconscious, shaping the course of human development. Historical convergences. At various points in history, simultaneous discoveries or events have occurred, shaping the course of human knowledge and culture. These can often be seen as synchronicities, suggesting an underlying connectedness in human thought and progress. Community synchronicities. Within smaller communities or groups, Shared synchronicities can lead to a strengthened sense of unity and purpose, guiding collective decisions or actions, embracing the mystery. As we conclude our exploration, remember that synchronicities offer a gateway to a richer and more mysterious world than the one we perceive with our five senses alone. By embracing the possibility of synchronicities, we open ourselves to a more enchanted and interconnected existence. This acceptance not only enhances personal growth and fulfillment, but also fosters a deeper connection with others and with the world around us. In embracing synchronicities, we acknowledge the mystery and wonder of life, allowing ourselves to be guided by both the seen and the unseen forces that shape our existence. Whether you view them as spiritual guides, psychological phenomena, or curious coincidences, synchronicities invite us to question, explore, and ultimately understand a little more about the complexities of life and our place within it. Thank you for joining me on this profound journey into the world of synchronicities. May you find meaningful connections and deeper insights as you navigate your path, attentive to the synchronicities that whisper the secrets of the universe.